Hey everybody, it's Streets back again with another review. You know, you love them, I love them, I love doing them for you. So, I'm not gonna deprive you of the viewer, the footage that you, that you want and deserve, first of all. Okay, so today, uh, I've got this uh, naturally bare, baked, crunchy, toasted coconut chips. Now, I love coconuts, I love the tropics, I like, you know, Florida. Um, and Tahiti. I love those places, uh, and I like coconut. I like coconut drinks, especially. Um, so I'm going to assess how good this coconut is. This coconut is because I've had a lot of coconut. Um, so we're gonna pop this right open. Let's get right into it. I don't want to waste any more time. Um, that came off pretty easily. Um, and right off the bat, you can smell uh, well coconuts. I don't know if you're familiar with the smell of coconuts. It's very distinctive. And for some reason, it smells a little bit like uh, buttered coconuts. It's not really that good, actually. Um, but I do like the smell of coconut. It has a bit of a weird smell. But regardless of what it smells like, let's get right into it and have a taste. So there's one. Okay, maybe one more. They're a little bit hard. I suppose they are chips, crunchy chips. Okay, it tastes it tastes good. It tastes um, I'll just lay it out. It tastes pretty good. Tastes like a coconut. Tastes like a, a roasted coconut, I suppose. Um, and I enjoyed it. It was good. Uh, it has it says here it has sugar and sea salt. So. I was smelling kind of like, you know, butter, but there isn't any of that in there. Um, all the shapes are interesting on them. There's a different shape. Every chip has one, um, kind of like Cheetos. Uh, but they don't taste like Cheetos. They taste like coconut. So they're kind of like coconut shavings. They're pretty good. If I'm going to rate them on taste and on presentation as well, um, the taste would be a 9 out of 10. Easy. The uh, appearance... It's a very nice, slick packaging. That's like a 9.5 out of 10. It's pretty good. I wanted to buy these because of how good they look from the packaging as well. Um, but if I'm going to critique the price, these were like, these are like, you know, $5. That's quite a bit for food. I could buy like a whole meal for my entire family for $5. So the price was bad. It was, you know, 3 out of 10. So if I'm going to rank this product overall, it's going to have to be a uh, probably an 8 out of 10. Still pretty good. Um, I'd, I'd eat these again. I'd recommend them. Um, tell a friend, uh, tell your grandma, um, go to the comments and say, I don't know, what, what your favorite uh, tropical fruit is, like a kiwi or something. Um, and I've been Street Eats. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel if you're new, if you like these reviews. Um, and I'll catch you next time. Don't forget to stay hungry, everyone. Goodbye.